My Facebook family and friends, this is GFAB Bray coming at you again with another Wifey Hunt update. And I know some of you guys haven't heard from me for a while. I've been having fun on my Wifey Hunt, y'all. I got to admit, I've been enjoying it. So these are <clears throat> three things I want to share with you today, and I'll give you a bonus. But the three things I want to share with you is three things that will make you irresistible to a man. Three things for a woman that will make you irresistible to a man, and I'll give you a bonus. Thing number one that will make you irresistible. Now, you may ask, well, why do I want to be irresistible to, irresistible, tongue -tied, to a man? And you want to maintain your, your attractiveness to a man. So, you know, you may know these things, women, and I'm learning still, too. But these three things, you got to take this to mind, some of you ladies, to make yourselves irresistible to a man. Thing number one is this. Your mouth. I'm not talking about how you use your mouth. That's for another video. I'm talking about what comes out of your mouth. Is your mouth, do you, do you use loving words? Are you, or are you always bickering and complaining? Do you use encouraging words? Or are you always you know, talking crap about whatever and just bringing up bad things? Or are you a pessimist? Now, some women have loud mouths. They can get them a man with no problem because they can scare a man into you know, being a boyfriend or husband, what have you. But if you want to be irresistible to a man, use your words and your tone lovingly. Come from a love perspective. Come from an optimist perspective. Don't be complaining about, you know, your day and your whatever. You can vent and you can, you know, talk, but use your words for the upliftment of that man. That's number one. Number two is this. I know you women are in the mirror with your makeup, your Mac, your Mary Kay, your Avon, your L'Oreal, whatever you use, your weave, your lace front, your wig. Your, your, your perm, your natural, your straight, your locks, whatever you got, your outfits, you spend a lot of time getting your outer beauty intact. And we appreciate that. Me of all men, I appreciate your outer beauty. However, your inner beauty, if you can spend 30 minutes getting your body prepared, your outer body prepared, some of you or some of us need to spend a few moments getting our inner beauty perfected how do we treat one another do we use the golden rule treat others as you as you want others to treat you or are you being rude to other people i i know some folks man that's i can't even go out with this individual because she is rude to everybody and i mean everybody and that's not the golden rule the golden rule is treat others as you will have them to treat you so is your inner beauty is it amazing if someone describes you to their friends, would they say, man, that girl, do she have a, no, it ain't just the fact that she got a big butt. It's the fact that she's a really good hearted, she's good people. She's good people and she's pretty. So let your beauty, your outer beauty be a bonus. The third thing to make you irresistible to a man. Now, I hope y'all taking notes. If not, rewind this and watch it again. Because some of y'all need to see this two, three, four, five times. But the third thing that will make you irresistible to a man is your attitude. Your attitude to a life, your attitude to a work. Uh, I met this lady one day and she talked about her job for about 30 minutes. And she complained for the whole 30 minutes. And in my mind, I'm thinking like, why would you go there every single day if all you're going to do is complain about it? So if you don't like it, don't go. That's just my opinion. However... Your attitude towards life, your friends or your spouse's children, your attitude toward your family, his family, the people who you share the role with, your attitude. You know, and I know sometimes we're going to get upset and have little issues. I'm not talking about that. But I'm talking about to make yourself irresistible to a man is have a good attitude, have your inner beauty in check, and use your, your mouth, your words for from a love perspective and for the upliftment of man. Now, all that being said, 
I told you three ways that's going to make you irresistible to a man. And I did say I was going to give you guys a bonus. So this is a bonus. And I'll give you a little story behind the bonus. A short story. Men are 99% ego. So if you, lady, now this is a tidbit. This is a golden nugget. If you can build that guy's ego, say things to him like, you so smart, you're so handsome, you're so brave, you're such a great provider. If you say things like that, that's what he will turn into, a man now. That's what he will turn into, and he will love to hear that. And that will build his ego. Build that man's ego up. You, you got you something there, okay? So I gave you guys three things, plus a bonus, four things, about how to make you irresistible to a man. Now, my name is G. Fabray. I am still on my wifey hunt, but I am so enjoying my wifey hunt. I'm enjoying it just as much as you guys enjoy watching it. So thank y'all for watching. Thank y'all for liking it. And if you got comments, I'm welcome. I welcome all the comments. I read the, uh, the emails. Thank you for those. Until next time, my name is G. Fabray. I love you, and I love you, and I love you too back there in the corner. Even though you talk on that junk, I love you too. Peace, one love. I'm out, folks. I'll see y'all next time. All right, peace.